Good day, Wonder Nurses. I'm Nurse Anne. Our video for today focuses on different NLE type exam question about our previous discussions, which are the syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone and diabetes insipidus. You can try to answer each question for 30 seconds and I will provide the link of the previous discussions in the description below. If you're ready, let's start! Question number one. A patient who recently underwent cranial surgery develops syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone. The nurse anticipates that the patient may. Your 30 seconds start now. The correct answer is letter B. The nurse anticipates that the patient with syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone may experience weight gain and edema. Question number two. The patient will undergo hypophysectomy on your shift. For clarification, the significant others ask the nurse, which gland will be removed during the procedure? The nurse must answer that it is the, your 30 seconds start now. The correct answer is letter D. It is the pituitary gland. Question number three. When carrying a patient being diagnosed with diabetes insipidus, the nurse must study and expect to administer which kind of medication? Your 30 seconds start now. The correct answer is letter C, desmopressin. Question number four. Which nursing diagnosis is most likely for a patient with an acute episode of diabetes insipidus? Your 30 seconds start now. The correct answer is letter A, deficient fluid volume. Question number five. A female patient was diagnosed with syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone and admitted for an emergency treatment. Which nursing intervention is appropriate? Your 30 seconds start now.
The correct answer is letter D. Restrict fluids. Thank you for your time. For the rationale behind the answers, I have a very brief discussion about syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone and diabetes insipidus, where you can find all the answers. Take time to watch if you have difficulty in answering the questions. All the best in your exams. Thank you for listening. I hope you learn and understand something. If you want more videos, don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.